Okay, this is continuing of threading your machine. So our stop point was this thread in here. You bring it through the back and you put it through that hoop and you just let it drop. You spin your wheel so that you can get access to the other side and you have this one. So again, it'll be in this position. When you spin your wheel, you need access to this hole to thread and we'll zoom in so you can see it. So if you see that brown, the brown thread is back behind this marker, you can see my, and then it went through here and now it drops. So now the piece that drops, you wanna pull it through this way and then we'll follow on the other side and you're gonna thread through here. So you would thread through there. So I'm gonna kinda of move it so when I put the thread through, I can actually pull it through the back, but this is a really tight space, but trust me, you'll get used to it. So I'm putting the thread through, I'll come out and go back in. You put that th thread through and you pull it out your back. You can stay right there. Yep. And if you have big fingers like me, you're gonna wanna use these tweezers. Okay, so now all your threads are through. So now your third one is your needle. And because we're threading, we might as well go through the needle too. So the needle is number three here, which is your red thread. So you're gonna start here, that's your antenna. It'll go through that same hoop, around that same circle, and through these hooks. So we'll start your red thread, which is number three, which is always your needle thread. It goes down, through, hoop, around your circle, and you see it fits off in here. So you'll take it, and you'll put it through there. It fits down through there. I'm gonna pull it back so it'll tighten back up for us, okay. <laughs> So it goes, you see all your green access points, and I'll show you on the diagram for number one. It goes down, goes through that loop, hoop, around that circle, and this is the position we just put in. It goes from there to this little, you see your green dot? Like I said, it's very simple. So you put it through there. You put it behind this hook. You see it's through there. It's behind this hook. I'll pull it out and put it back in. Behind this hook. Then it comes through here, it goes through that hoop, and then you thread your needle like we did in the beginning. I'll move that orange so you can see the needle. Okay, then we'll do a slow stitch to pull everything through. So pull all three of your threads to the back. You don't have to pull them forcefully. We'll close this, close this. And you have threaded your machine. So I would say take that small green piece of thread that came with your machine and just run it through to get a clean stitch going before you start on your mask. So I'm gonna let that down and I'm gonna just run this through very slow. And if you go up, you'll see all of your threads moving. You wanna make sure they're moving good. And then I'll cut off. And that first stitch, I always go very slow, just only because, and as you see, you should have a perfect stitch. All right, if you guys have any questions, call us, 317-835-5139. Happy sewing!